A great loss. We lost a pioneer and a true innovator, Mr. Earl Scruggs. Before he started playing banjo, it was really played with a pick and with your kind of with your hands and your fingers in a weird claw hammer way. Um, he started, he, he did on the three finger style out of hearing different influences, and that's, um, and every other player pretty much after that has tried to copy him, but none have been fully successful because there's only one Earl Scruggs. Bill Monroe, the father of Bluegrass, founder of Scruggs. When Earl was 21 years old, um, Earl's unique three-finger style was the sound that Monroe had been searching for. And in December of 1945, when Earl Scruggs on the banjo, Lester Flat on the guitar, Bill Monroe on the mandolin, <clears throat> Tubby Wise on the fiddle, and Cedric Rainwater on the bass, when they took the stage at the Ryan Auditorium in Nashville, bluegrass music was truly born. Without Earl Scruggs, there might never have been a bluegrass like this, loved by millions around the world. Um, Earl now plays in the Angel Band up in heaven, and we honor him and thank him with these songs. The first one will be Foggy Mountain Breakdown.